Now to an update in the deadly stabbing of Robert Marshall from last week. Local 5's Timothy Lateau joins us outside of the Brown County Courthouse where two suspects were just officially charged. Timothy. Yeah, Caitlin, Aaron Walton and Joseph Poor have just been officially charged in the death of Robert Marshall, who died after being stabbed five times last Monday. Now, according to the criminal complaint, Walton and Poor took a trip to Indiana with Marshall. On the way back, there was an alleged dispute between the suspects of whether to steal from Marshall. In the complaint, the suspects say Marshall took out a scale and drugs, and that's when Marshall was stabbed in the abdomen and chest, piercing his heart. Both suspects were vague in their interviews with detectives, pointing fingers at each other and saying they weren't sure what was happening. The complaint states that detectives recovered the knife allegedly used in the stabbing on the Mason Street Bridge. And in an exclusive interview, Marshall's boss at the moving company he worked for told me he wants him to be remembered as a smart-minded, hard-working man. I have to uh, speak uh, the positive things that I know about Rob and his, his steps that he took to overcome any injustices or things that he might have been dealing with in life. He's really an intelligent person. And both Walton and Poor have preliminary hearings scheduled for mid-July. We'll bring you updates as we get them. For now, live in Green Bay, Timothy Lateau, Local 5 News.